Hi everyone. For some time now, I've been looking for a good RV wall safe. I like the Dometic wall safe, but it's just too big and heavy. So watch my video and I'll show you what I did. Harbor Freight. There we are, Harbor Freight. Memorial Day sale. Where is it? Uh, it is right. There's the safes. Okay. This one is the middle one. This weighs about weighs about 15 pounds, near as I can tell. Yeah, it weighs about 15 pounds. Let's see how big it is. Where's my ruler? And it is 14 by 10. 14 by 10 by 10. So it's 14 by 10 by 10. Okay. Now, there's this one. This one's huge. Not how much this one weighs. It weighs about 35 pounds. Wow, it weighs about 35 pounds, and boy, you know it. Okay, that one weighs about 35 pounds. Now this one, this little tiny one, this little tiny one weighs just under 10 pounds. This one weighs just under 10 pounds, and it's 11 by 8 by 9. So it's 11 by 8 by 9. Okay. So this one, the 11 by 8 by 9 is $29, and that is way too small. And this one here is $34 with 20% off. And this was this was 14 by 10 by 10. This is the one I bought because I thought it was just about the right size. And this one here, this one weighs 35, this one here weighs 35 pounds. And it looks like it's built better, but it's huge. It is 16 by 11 and a half. 16 by 11 and a half by by almost 12. 16 by 11 by 11 and a half by 12. Okay, and they all have the same features. There's a digital wall safe. This is a digital wall safe. Let's see what this weighs. Oh my God. If this is right, it weighs 32 pounds. This one weighs 32 pounds. And it's uh, roughly 16 by by five and a half, 16 by, by five and a half by 24, pretty big. And what I say, like 35 pounds. Okay. I 
bought one of these. This is pretty nice. I bought one of these. Put it in my RV. This one's too small. This one might take like a gun. That's be about it. Well, you looking for something small like that? Well, you. Can, I mean, if they if they want to get in, they're going to get in anyway. But this will deter them. This is the one I bought. I like it. This plate comes off, and there's a key in there. In case you, and initially when you start it, you know, got to get in to get the batteries and everything. See the bolts here you got? It's built pretty good. What I did was I drilled holes in it, put one on each side, four in the bottom, and bolted it in. Two by four it in. So, you know, I mean, it only keeps the honest honest. Yeah. But if they don't have a lot of time and they're busting into a place, they want to get in and out of there. They don't want to screw with something like this. They might hit it with a hammer a few times. Yeah. You know, and you know what a safe is good for? A safe is a good distraction because if you've got valuables in the other part of the house and they're working their ass off to get in here, and there's nothing in there. Put a note in there. Well, there's nothing. There might not be anything. You know what we used to do in a restaurant? They had this big safe, and they broke in like four times within one month. I don't know what happened after that because they didn't come back. Sorry, for security reasons, I couldn't show everyone how or where I put the safe in my RV. Thanks for watching.